developing now a child kidnapped in the south suburbs. The abduction, as you can see here, is caught on camera. And today, the FBI is asking that you look closely at this video, this frightening video, to give them help. Good afternoon. I'm Erica Sargent. Rob is off today. The suspect is in custody, charged with kidnapping. CBS 2's Vince Girasoli with more now on the crime and why federal agents are asking for your help. Federal authorities want us to see it. A girl innocently walking down a street. A man standing just a few feet away as she approaches. Look here as he quickly grabs the girl and forces her into his red Ford Explorer. Moments later, he drives away. It was just 3.30 in the afternoon. It's very difficult to watch this video, isn't it? Frankly, I was horrified by what I, what I saw in that video. The suspect has been identified as 38-year-old Brian Protho of East Chicago, Indiana. After leaving this Calumet City location last December 20th, he reportedly parked the car in a nearby alley and assaulted the girl. Somehow, she was able to escape, flag down a passing vehicle, and contact authorities. Pratha was arrested a week later. This child um, remarkably and very courageously was able to escape the grips of this, of this offender, and, and fortunately she's alive here today to tell that story. The FBI is sharing the video to encourage anyone with information to come forward. According to CBS2 security consultant Ross Rice, a former special agent with the FBI. They're looking for other potential victims. It's quite possible that he might have tried to abduct someone else earlier in the afternoon. It's very rare that we would see an event like this. Robert Lowry is president of the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children. He says of the 20,500 cases reported last year of missing or abducted children, only 1% were non-family abductions. We don't want to frighten our children to the point that they don't leave their homes, kick, scream, fight, do whatever they can to get away from that situation. Now, Cook County Pratho has two previous felony convictions for which he was sentenced to time in prison. He's pleaded guilty to several weapons charges in the past. He's now charged with one count of kidnapping, and if guilty, he could serve 20 years to life in prison. You know, Eric, it's hard to see what he uh, looks like in that video, yes. but if you notice that car, red Ford Explorer SUV, that's key. If anyone thinks they saw that car earlier, maybe someone in their family came into contact with him, that's what federal authorities are after tonight. Right, and it seems to be key here that there were surveillance cameras in this neighborhood to be able to capture this for us all to see as well. Authorities say with more and more of us having surveillance cameras around our houses, they've actually helped to drive down instances like this. Uh, and. One thing to commend that girl for, she was able to get out of that situation after a bit. He quite possibly could have harmed her even more than he did. Right. All right. Thank you, Vince.